everyone, welcome to my next studio renovation vlog. I'm not sure what part this is, but today I have been cracking on with painting the ceiling and sanding the ceiling. We are almost finished with it. As you can see, I am literally covered in paint and just crap in general. <laughs> the roof is almost finished. It's one of those things where I could spend a long, long time perfecting it. But I've got to the stage now where the roof looks good and that's all I need. It's not perfect, but I'm happy with that. Plus, I just want to get on to completing the walls, sorting the floor. The floor will be getting floorboards and levelling at some point, like I've said before. But I think for now we are just going to paint it. Right now, it's like almost just cosmetic things that need to be finished. The surround of the door where the doors were put in needs finishing and also the door needs painting but I've just been finishing it off painting that today, uh, painting the base coat sorry and like corking it and just finishing it off a bit and sanding it. That's what I've been doing, I feel like I've just got loads of little jobs to do before like it can be completed. Um, but I'm just so excited because it's almost there and you know when you're just getting towards the end of a project and I feel like I've been doing this for the past four days now and I just want it to be finished. Over the weekend we did a bit of um, pruning of the garden, made sure that that was coming along as well as the inside. Uh, so this is what we've got so far. Took the um, ivy off this wall here and we also I shaped this bush and this bush. This needs levelling. Um, we're going to be putting some paving stones. I think I'm going to get some proper paving stones to actually like level it out a little bit. There's Peppy. Peppa, come here then. He's been a good guard dog. I've sanded and painted the bottom parts over there and over on this side. Then I've sanded this top part here, just this section. And I need to just move this um, scaffolding over to this side so that I can finish off that part, which I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna get back on with sanding this ceiling. Probably should do this with someone else, but Jack's not here today, he's at work. And it's just me on my own. This chair has just been hovering about the studio for months. <laughs> we found it at one of my parents' properties and I washed it up and I liked it, so I'm gonna keep it and I might reupholster it at some point. My issue here is now that I've got a beam and I need to get this to this side, so I'm gonna to have to take it all apart. The joys of working on the done I've just done like pretty much I think my last coat of paint it's a little bit blotchy on here but I think that's because it's wet still and then I've just give these a coat of spray wood stain so they're a bit darker now and these are gonna go here and here to cover those little bits and the gaps Good afternoon, it's the next day and it's currently quarter to three and this morning I've spent doing some editing and just catching up on a bit of work because I've had about four or five days in the studio. Today I'm going to be putting up the triangles. I think the studio needs one more coat of paint but I don't think it's like totally necessary at this point because I've done so many coats of paint on it but I feel like one more might not hurt and I feel like I'm in this stage now where I just want to get the roof finished and then I can do the wall. Currently just deciding if to actually do another coat of paint and then I want to put up the triangles which is the final touch. I was going to paint them white just so that they like blended in but I've decided to keep them just wood and stain them 
So I stained them yesterday, I've left them for 24 hours now, and I'm gonna go and put them up. I'm very excited. I mean, I should really do the paint first, but we'll see. I'm gonna get in there and have a look, and I'll let you know. These have dried quite good. Um, so these are gonna go up in the triangles up there. I think that's gonna look so good against the wall, look. I'm so happy about that. But I just need to get some screws and electric screwdriver. Um, and I also need to just measure the thickness so I can get the right screws. This one is gonna go on this side, up there. Let's see what this is gonna look like. There we go. Done! That's so exciting. It's looking so good, I'm so pleased. I feel like now this is done, it's wall time and I'm gonna be painting them white. I've just come back into my office and here's Rosie, hello. <laughs> and I'm just so proud of us. Like I've just put that triangle up and it just felt really good. Yeah, I think me and Jack have just been in like this journey over the past, since probably like July last year and it felt like a long slog doing that roof, um, especially doing it in our own time, whenever we could fit it in. And now I feel like I can see the finish line. So I've been really putting all my effort into it. And the bits that need doing are kind of like the end bits, the bits that like are just gonna be finishing touches. Yeah, so I just need to like seal the walls, paint the walls, paint the floor, but it's all basically comes cosmetic at this point. I need the builders to come and finish the door because there's a brick missing out of it and you know there's just bits and bobs that need to be done like painting the door and everything but again it's cosmetic so we can just paint it and it will not take us too long hopefully. I've said this throughout this whole project and it's always taken four times as long but we're getting there and yeah just putting those triangles up today has made me feel really like proud of what we've done over this past year. It's cost me a little bit of money to like get all the materials in, but basically it's just the time that we've put into it has taught me so much patience and value. It just gives me a real big sense of achievement and I'm really happy with it. Uh, I'm gonna leave this video here um, and I'll catch up on my next one and hopefully on the next one we'll be doing walls, floor and all that jazz. So yeah, see you later, bye.